Maverick's owner Mark Cuban picked up Delant West at a gas station in Dallas on Monday and is attempting to get help for the former Mavericks player, according to a TMZ report. Sources close to West told TMZ that friends and family have been trying to get West to go to a drug rehabilitation facility, and Cuban has offered to pay for treatment. West, who disclosed his bipolar disorder diagnosis in 2009, has struggled with off-the-court issues for years. In two videos that went viral in January, West was shown being hit by another man in a street outside Washington, D.C., while the other video showed a shirtless, handcuffed West being asked about the attack. Cuban, former teammates and coaches have previously expressed concern for West. Cuban reportedly made a recent attempt to help West after photos of him panhandling at a Dallas intersection circulated last week. In a 2012 interview with the Dallas Morning News, West was open about his diagnosis in a late September 2009 arrest. In that instance, West was pulled over after cutting off a police officer on his motorcycle just outside of Washington, D.C., where West grew up. The officer discovered West was carrying multiple guns and a Bowie knife and West eventually pleaded guilty to two misdemeanors and was sentenced to home detention, probation, community service and counseling. West played for the Mavericks during the 2011-12 season. He averaged 9.7 points and 3.6 assists throughout his eight seasons in the NBA. Find more Mavericks stories from the Dallas Morning News here.